Here we're going to do an example of calculating the fixation probability for the Moran process on the game 4114. Uh, four. And we're going to assume that we have n equals 4. So the idea is that we have um, four individuals of, uh, three individuals of the second type, and we've got one individual of the first type, and we want to know what's the probability that they're able to take, take over based on the fact that any given individual's fitness is given by this game matrix. So I'm just going to apply the um, theory. So we have that F1i is equal to 4 times i minus 1 um, plus 4 minus i divided by 3. If I expand that out, I get um, 4i minus 4 plus 4 minus i divided by 3, um, which is just equal to i. Similarly, F2i is equal to i plus 4 times 3 minus i, everything divided by 3, which is equal to 12 minus 3i divided by 3, which is just equal to 4 minus i. And then um, once we've done that, we, we really need this, this gamma i, which is just the ratio of of these two things, so it's F2i divided by F1i, which is equal to 4 minus i divided by i, 4 over i minus 1. And so this is the, the thing we're going to need for our uh, formula. So x1 is, I'm just going to write out the formula again, x1 is 1 plus, and so it's the sum from j equals 1 to i minus 1, so that's 0. So actually, I could stop here because there's a sum over nothing. Um, but I'll, I'll keep going just for completeness. k equals 1 times j of uh, gamma k and divided by 1 plus the sum from j equals 1 to uh, 3 of the product from k equals 1 to j of gamma k. Um, and that is just equal to 1. All of this is just the sum over nothing. This set here doesn't really make any sense. Um, 1 divided by 1 plus, um, well, let me uh, let me go straight ahead. So um, it's going to be um, gamma 1. So when j is equal to 1, I'm taking the product from k equals 1 to 1 of gamma k. So that's gamma 1. Plus, now when j is equal to 2, I've got the product from k equals 1 to 2, so gamma 1 times gamma 2. Plus, when j is equal to 3, I've got gamma 1 times gamma 2 times gamma 3. Um, and now I just take this thing here and put it into that expression, um, which is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus 3 plus 3 times 1 plus 3 times 1 times a third, which after a um, tiny bit of algebra is equal to 1 over 8. And so the probability that a given individual of um, the first type uh, takes over a population when there's a total number of 4 is 1 over 8.